Hi there, everybody. A domestic trophy is up for grabs today. A fine piece of silverware, the Carabao Cup. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Special day for us and for the players, of course, as well. It's West Ham United, and they take on Burnley. Yeah, special day for all concerned. They've worked extremely hard to get to this point, these two teams, and the supporters of both sides will just be hoping that they can uh, produce the best on the big day. That'll be a throw. West Ham United's lineup is this. Lucas Fabianski plays in goal. Fabian Balbuena plays alongside Issa Diop in defence. Mark Noble plays with Jack Wilshire in the middle. Only one up front in terms of the out-and-out -out forward. This is the Burnley lineup. In goal today, Nick Pope. Matthew Lowton starts with Eric Peters as the pullbacks. Jack Cork starts with Ashley Westwood in central midfield. And they've gone with two up front today. Well, you've got to compliment him for trying, but that's well off target. Westwood. Matt Lowton, good Munson. Well, he could be the star turn in this game. There's a lot of quick players about, but uh, it's not always easy to use that speed, but this boy has mastered that to a T. Rice, Ale. Well, there's one for him to chase in behind. the way to win the ball back they've got the ball back by that interception and that will clear the danger Jack Wilshire Felipe Anderson well, this is where the space is at the moment on the flanks chance to cross it Final this, but we've got the first goal now. Well, here is a player that tends to produce when it matters, certainly matters today. And it's worked for West Ham. Well, coming in from the right, that was so inviting, wonderful delivery. Great ball, great goal. Another angle on it here. West Ham are in the lead. Goal for West Ham United. Number 10, Manuel Lazzini. A couple of teammates up in support, trying to lift it over the nearest defender and he couldn't. And they've spread it out wide here. Now Tarkovsky. Lanzini. Now he wants to take them on. Now he can play it into the danger area. That could have been difficult, but the defender sorted it out. Good Munson. Well, they couldn't keep possession, they've given it away. Well, the team with the ball have got a problem now because the opposition are just sitting behind the ball and letting them pass in front they've got to find some attacking players with Alan! really wanted to put his laces through it but couldn't direct it well, he had one or two options left and right there Jack Wilshire, Sebastian Haller, guiding it through. Felipe Anderson, a real opening for him. 
Oh, it's a long way away from the target. He was so close in. Well, that's a howler, and he's uh, getting some stick off those supporters. Westwood, Jack Cork, Barnes. Well, they are moving the ball well here. Really in the clear now, in on goal. Normally calm enough in these circumstances, but not at this big moment. Yeah, you would normally see him tucked that away, no problem. Jack Wilshire, Halle, Noble, Felipe Anderson, room for the cross. Well, it was considered controlled attacking play, but it's come to nothing in the end. Halle! Oh, just shaved the bar. Yeah, unlucky. Hits it well enough. Good look and decided what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Felipe Anderson. That's it! In with the header and a good position, but he's put it wide. Yeah, it's a good chance. Not sure if that came off his shoulder, you know. Didn't look a clean connection. at 1-0 big game with big pressures on the players but they've responded well haven't they they're in
And with the league season about to begin, we have action coming up from the curtain raiser, the Community Shield. It's Brighton and Hove Albion up against Watford. Well, these games are about getting players fit, both physically and mentally, but there's also trophies to be won. Community Shield, tick that box. I've won that a couple of times. I've also lost it a couple of times as well. It should be a cracker, Derek, that's for sure. And the team selected for Brighton and Hove Albion. In goal for this match, it's Matthew Ryan. Shane Duffy plays alongside Lewis Dunk in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Just wanted to get it out of there. And so the initial 11 for Watford. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. Shot attempted and a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort, he smashed it. Poor pass under no real pressure. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Kapu now. It's with Dukure. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, it's off the post! Well, from a seemingly impossible angle, not far away at all. Well, he thought he had a decent chance to score. I'm not sure his teammates did, though, but a little bit unlucky. Davy Proper. Gross. He has time to play it over. It comes to nothing. In possession, Deo Lefeu. Deo Lefeu. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Stevens. Pascal Gross. Gross. Murray. Given away. Stevens. Now in possession, Kosar. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Hughes. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. It's with Dukure. Wonderful chance! An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got his positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. Roberto Pereira has it. Antini on the ball. Dukure. On and on he goes. Danger averted. In possession, Femenia. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. So tight this game. Who's going to break the deadlock? Be brave, be a hero, take chances. Couldn't hang on to it. Clattered away. Gross. Pascal Gross giving them the gift of possession and scope for them to produce something exciting Running to the goal that puts them ahead and he got to it fairly easily
Groß. Prepare. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique really, and the goalkeeper's not troubled. The fourth official has indicated. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Attempted and a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort. He smashed it. Happy to take on the shot. Well, from a seemingly impossible angle, not far away at all. Well, he thought he had a decent chance to score. I'm not sure he.